Allah has littered the road to victory with many trials. As you overcome these ordeals, you will become stronger and more tolerant. You are the protector of Allah's oppressed servants. Allah will not abandon you nor forsake you, Allah willing. Our hand is but flesh and bone. When we trust in our own power and squeeze that hand, that hand becomes a fist. Someone stronger can nevertheless beat us. If we trust in Allah's might and power, when we squeeze a hand into a fist, no army on earth would be strong enough to stop us. The events which took place immediately before the Battle of the Trench teach believers an important lesson. The mounted warriors of the Meccan pagan army screamed at the Muslims, asking for a man to fight their champion. Their champion was Amr ibn Abd al -Wud. He was a famous horseman, good with his sword, but of course nobody wanted to face him. But Hazrat Ali, peace be upon him, said, O Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, I will fight him. But as it was, Amr ibn Abd al -Wud, he said he wanted to to fight. Our Prophet, peace be upon him, told him to sit down. Amr challenged the Muslims again. Is no man among you prepared to fight? Where is the heaven you promised your dead? Hazrat Ali, peace be upon him, wanted again to fight him. Our Prophet, peace be upon him, said, O oh Ali, he is Amr ibn Abdul Wud. Hazrat Ali, peace be upon him, said he understood what he was about to do and would fight him. Thus our Prophet, peace be upon him, let the Lion of Allah fight. He helped him into his armour himself, and he prayed as he put the sword called Zulfikar around his waist. He removed his own turban and wrapped it around Hazrat Ali, peace be upon him's head, then raised his hands in prayer. O oh Allah, obeyed, my uncle's son was martyred in Badr. My uncle Hamza was martyred in Uhud. I have only my cousin, Ali, left. Protect him. Help him. Do not leave me here alone. So the fight began on the battlefield, and everyone awaited the result. Amr, being a seasoned warrior, destroyed Hazrat Ali, peace be upon him's shield, with a single blow. His sword pierced the shield and brushed Hazrat Ali, peace be upon him's forehead. Hazrat Ali, peace be upon him, jumped to the side as fast as lightning. It was his turn. He landed a heavy blow on Amr's neck with Zulfikar. Suddenly screams broke out. Everything was in confusion. Amr ibn Abd al -Wud, the famous pagan warrior, lay in the dirt covered in blood with his head cut off. Hazrat Ali, peace be upon him, Lion of God, screamed, Allah is great, so loudly that it echoed around the battlefield. That scream was the reason behind their victory that day.